you're Serena Sarducci? Don't ask. Just uh, call me The Ox. Okay. Sorry to have kept you waiting so long. Uh, we just wanted to review your data one more time before we talk. I think the results speak for themselves. You know what my formula can do. Well, yes, and therein lies the problem. I would call it a problem so much as a bump in the road. Doctor, your, your bump in the road will kill over a billion people. You can't let the lives of a few people stand in the way of the greatest scientific achievement in history to come to life. That's true, but a one in four chance of death versus immortality seems like a big gamble. My shot will cure everything. Everything. Millions of people will never have to suffer again. You could get hit by a train and walk away without a scratch. You'd live forever. We're not disagreeing with you. Besides, we're not exactly novices at handling up controversial products. And that's why I came to your company. So we have a deal then. As long as the check clears. Lawyer's on his way right now. I have all the necessary paperwork. Come back within an hour. With the formula, and we'll make you richer than you ever dreamed. Don't go anywhere. I have big plans for that money. Big plans. Christ, you scared the shit out of me. Doc, you remember why, we, why you hired me to begin with? You couldn't afford your child support payments? <laughs> and you needed a glorified bodyguard? Now why on earth would you need a bodyguard? It's my business. Yeah, well, you know, when you're a cop, you learn a few interesting things. Now, you may ask what? Well, I'll give you a couple examples. I can put a bug in something that small. And I could find out damn well anything that what I want doing? to about anybody. What are you doing? Like, you, you son of a there? bitch. You were doing this all for him, weren't you? Your little baby boy had leukemia. Don't you talk about my boy. And nothing you could do could save him, could it? He died before the formula was finished. And you thought you were going to broker some kind of deal with this pissant pharmaceutical company and leave me hanging high and dry, didn't you? I don't owe you anything. Oh, I think you do, sweetheart. I was going to make a lot of money off this little transaction. I trusted you to protect me. Sorry, but I'm not leaving empty-handed. It's not that we didn't trust you, my dear doctor, but uh, you're dealing with something this big. You don't leave anything to chance. You're doing business with you. Sneaky bitch. <laughs> Looks like it worked. Give some of that shit to me.